Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well this evening. Let's do some check in and see what is happening, shall we? Is it that the collective needs to know at this time? What the energy is that we got going on in here? got the chariot here so somebody has gained a victory over something challenge two of pentacles somebody's weighing their options They could be perhaps trying to negotiate. There's been a victory and somebody's trying to negotiate. They're weighing their options. Subconscious. Whoever this victor is, they're passionate about it. Or whoever it is that's really determined. We've got uh, the world card, and as it came out, it flipped into the reverse. So um, somebody um, is not getting closure. They weren't able to complete a cycle. Intentions and expectations. Hmm. They were expecting to quickly move into a solid foundation. They were seeking shortcuts. to gain a final, uh, a solid foundation in the near future. We have a, um, there is the love and harmony coming together, the lovers and the three of cups. So there are unions coming together. There's a, 
there is a union and there's it's it's being celebrated. That could be these who had gained a victory. Somebody who's passionate and fearless. They could be um, challenged by needing to balance whatever it is they got going on. They're impulsive. The lens that's being looked through is the Eight of Pentacles in the upright. So hard work. Perhaps learning a new skill, getting a new job. In the environment, we've got temperance, so balance and harmony. Some there's a meaning and a purpose to life. Hopes and fears. Conflict. Somebody wants to bring conflict to this. They don't want these lovers being celebrated or experiencing harmony or balance. So they want to bring conflict. And the outcome, what do we have in the outcome, Spirit? What do we have in the outcome? A victory. You gain a you gain a victory over this situation. So victory, it starts out with a victory. The chariot, victory. You're going on a journey. Okay, you're going to be um, challenged by balancing everything that needs to be done. Like, hopefully you've been <laughs> practicing your ability to multitask. In the subconscious, be highly energetic and excited about this new journey. You could be feeling really good about yourself. Somebody in the past was attempting to take a shortcut with the intention to quickly gain a solid foundation. Or maybe it is that you gained a victory over um, whoever it is in the subconscious, this Knight of Wands in the subconscious. This Knight of Wands could have come in as like a, like a passionate, charming person uh, wanting to gain um, some sort of a connection, whether it be business or otherwise. So this is why it's in the subconscious, this energetic, inspired person. 
wanted to come up and be business partners. That's what this is, negotiations. You're weighing your options. And it looks like this Knight of Wands didn't, wasn't able to complete whatever they were looking for. They were hoping to quickly come in and, and hop onto your solid foundation. It didn't work. You're moving forward into the actual love relationship and it's being celebrated. You didn't fall for this. You're moving into a state where you're gonna be working with high standards, very diligently. Positive mindset, positive potentials. Learning how to master um, whatever it is that you've got going on, you know, whatever it is that you have decided to put forth the effort with. Balance and harmony is in the environment. Now, there is somebody wanting to bring conflict here, but you gain a victory over that. That's so cool, man. It begins with a victory and it ends with victory. Even though there are, um, like, there's still these um, energies that wish to bring conflict. They're, they're present. You know, everybody's aware of them. They're here. They're, they're certainly here. They're coming in the dream state, you know, there's, there's, there's the, but. I love this stuff. Sort quake. It feels really cool um, on the fingers. It's glycerin based. If you've ever used glycerin based lotion, you'll know that um, it's very, very nice for the for the skin. Anyhow, we got blind faith, the fool on the bottom of the deck. New beginnings, possibilities, blind faith. Huh? This is an adventure. King of Cups is here, dis diplomatic leader. Searching for a purpose within a Two of Cups to manifest um, and collaborate long-term uh, rewards for um, goals, you know. And here you've got the lovers and the community. So it's... Um, bigger than just it's bigger than just you know two people coming together although it could be um the lovers could be a contract for a community Or it could be an actual union. Knight of Wands, yeah. Sovereign. Sovereign. You're sovereign. You're a sovereign being. Hmm? You gained a victory. You gained a victory. You're a person of service, huh?
You're going to be challenged by having to multitask. There's going to be a lot going on. Your schedule is going to be very busy. You're going to be challenged by people who are going to want to pull your strings. You are challenged by the puppet masters who want to send in their representative to pull your strings. To cause you the need um, to juggle, to put you in this state, right? You're a sovereign being. You're coming into a, a role of service. You have won a victory over whatever you've gained the journey your, your 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 determination has allotted you this position yes there's somebody here who wants to come in and puppet you and keep you in in this state this is a knight of wands somebody who's coming in all passionate energetic and sexy I'm charming you know labor they're working hard at it they're working hard at um, coming in here getting in here you're aware of it it's in the subconscious. You're challenged by it, but you're aware of it. So it's not like you're not aware of it. Whatever it is, it's incomplete. This person trying to get a shortcut by getting with you, it doesn't work. It's incomplete. There's no closure. That's it. It's like, um, so we've got grave and the world reversed. So there's no closure. It's incomplete. It's either the end or, or there's an actual grave. This could be an end of all of this. Intention and expectation was to quickly gain a solid foundation. Or maybe the expectation was that the lovers were going to be quickly gaining a solid foundation. And these ones wanted to come in and get on that, get on that path. And it didn't work out. didn't work out. They have addictions. It could be that their intention was to um, cause addictive behavior within this cycle that's happening very quickly. It could be that they've been doing something to try to bring that into the new cycle for these lovers. It could be that they've been um, doing some sort of graveyard magic to try to 
cause addictive behaviors within this new foundation, which is um, very um, stable and secure financially and uh, foundationally. But in the near future, the lovers are coming together. The power of two together is a very um, passionate union. And it's being celebrated by a community. Remember, and this could be a return to... Um, to the mother. A return to the mother. The mother is going to be remembered in this new cycle. The mother will be celebrated in this new cycle. And I know that, you know, um, in many instances, she is. However, the end of the last cycle really did a number on those relationships for many people. So I think this is really wonderful, you know, that there is a return to. You know, in the previous, in the religious cycle, um, it was all about the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, but they never talked about the Mother, and I really like that. The Mother is going to be remembered in the near future. A celebration. So, there's going to be a lot of passion about the work that is that has been done and that um, will continue to be done and it's going to be um, authentic whatever work um, you do it will be authentic there's not going to be any acting pretend there's no pretend it's going to be harmonious. Things are going to be in moderation, you know, balance. A space where people will have the opportunity to find their purpose rather than being rushed here and rushed there, led here and led there, you know. This is what you shall be. A return to sensibility. The state of being sensible. And we've got things. Things. Moderation. And you see that these things that this man has, it's all contained in a very small basket. Moderation. Temperance. Where the work one does is... is You know the sense of of um, applying a high a sense of high standards to your effort, rather than the things you collect, right? So there's kind of a subtle shift. Whereas 
the um, the focus now, the the passion and the uh, effort goes into developing those those skills and abilities, not in the material things that you can collect. I think that's pretty cool. But somebody does have a hope of um, bringing conflict here with the Five of Wands. They want to change this outcome. They don't like this change. But you gain a victory over this. Arcana. You could be an Arcana. You could have the support of an Arcana. You've got the remember the mother there. You've got the remember the mother there. So it could be that you are an archonic mother, like a world mother, a real world mother, not, you know, a woman of the world mother, but a real like earth mother, spirit mother. Somebody, there are new beginnings here, and somebody is very vain. Somebody's having an issue with vanity right now. They could be um, feeling sensitive. It could be that somebody's laughing at them. And they're trying to hide. They're very vain. And you're just sitting here peaceful, minding your own business. You you know where you're going and you're and you're heading on your way. You got your compass. People were always competing with you, but you're just kind of moving along, all optimistic, forgiving people, having faith and stuff. Just a wholesome person, you know, a real sweetheart. Religious martyrs. Religious people coming in and martyring themselves over some promise that this conscientious person is receiving. You know, these players aren't happy about this prophecy. The teacher is going home or is home with the kindred spirits here and now, evermore, evermore. It's time. It's time. This leaves this leaves um, some folks haunted. This leaves some 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 vain folks haunted, feeling haunted. Sorry, this is taking a long time. I'm just. I guess I'm just being slow. So there's a victory. You're a sovereign being. You're a being who is, who, who has chosen to be of service, right? To the, to that divinity called life. You, you're getting a new job or a career. Okay. You're a sovereign being of service. You're going to be challenged by a very full schedule. And people who will be wanting to drag you here and drag you there, lead you around by your nose and dictate to you what you shall do. You're going to be challenged by this because you've got to stand firm in your sovereignty regardless of what anybody else wants from you or for you you can't lose the inner essence of that mindset and everything that it took to get you to this place right so you can't let all these other outside sources say okay here's where you're going to go and this is what you're going to do and this is what you're going to talk about and blah blah blah, blah. And you're no longer the person that gained the victory. You have been stripped of those qualities. So just 
be aware of that, all right? This is a challenge. Yeah, there's something important, such as a new job or a raise. You're getting a new career. It's going to be challenging. A chain of events that will affect your life are coming up. And it will require a commitment. It will be an obligation. You have psychic ability and you need to learn to trust your intuition. Okay, you, you may be challenged by this, but there's probably been plenty of times in your life where you were offered a new position or a new opportunity and something inside of you, even though you had no idea what you were doing, said, try it, try it, right? Just to see if you can. Just to see if you can. So this Knight of Wands, who is working against this, he wants to, he wants to hop in and he's doing stuff. He wants to hop in and take part in this solid foundation. They have addiction. They're, they're a turkey. They're behaving stupidly. You are highly thought of. They think highly of you. They wouldn't want to be on your foundation if they didn't. They think highly of you. They want to come in and be Prince Charming. Um... You know, they're interested in more than just some passing fancy. You are on the road to success, the mountain road, but it came out in reverse. So they're not going to succeed here. You're hardly thought of, but they won't, they won't get anywhere with this. And that's shown here also in the recent past because we have grave, which could be an end to... Um, whatever this is. Yeah, we got the world in reverse. So there is no closure. There's an incompletion. They weren't able to do whatever. There's a, a great worry over nothing. This is over. They can't come in. They've got addictions. They, they were wanting to swiftly get on your foundation. Sometimes you can get real fast at that, right? Wow, look at that. This is busy, man. This is a busy time, okay? You've got January, February, and June here. Something very quickly is happening here with the Four of Pentacles, right? An improvement. Some sort of a solid foundation is going to be or oh, some sort of wealth, security. Something could happen in January and February very quickly. And by June, um, something could be blooming in your life that you weren't expecting. The frigidness of January and the winds of February, that movement that starts blowing everything around, right? And then you got the blooms coming in in June. So everything starts to have fruit. Everything starts to flower by June. The mother is going to be remembered in the... Um, near future she will be brought back to the forefront of minds she had been um, erased and so she's going to be remembered now there's a celebration the lovers are coming back together 
older woman dealings or relationship with an older woman. There could be an older woman here. And we've got April. Look, January, February, April, June. This is a busy year. A new job where you can just be you. You can be free to be me, right? Oh, and you won't get fired. <laughs> That's always nice, right? So you're gonna have you, you're gonna want to pay attention to your health. And things will not always be this way. A change is coming. A change is coming. Slowly but surely, a change is coming, right? We've got diligence, hard work. It's an apprenticeship. Caterpillar, slow moving, diligence. Balance and harmony are restored. This is right here. The things are minor. Um, there's there's not a lot of things, right? There's an emphasis being placed on something greater than material things. Getting together with friends. You feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or goals, but this came out in the reverse. You may have fewer things, but you're you're going to have all these friends. You're not going to be feeling like you're lacking anything. Somebody wants to bring conflict to this change, right? There's a change here, and they, they don't like it. They're going to be suffering a period of ill health and depression. This change causes somebody to um, not be doing well. You gained a victory over them. You Maybe you become Arcana. Maybe you're guided by Arcana. Maybe you've gained recognition by the Arcana. Maybe you receive a promotion. Maybe you receive a promotion. As an arcana. Huh? Maybe. Maybe you get a maybe you get a promotion. Whoa, holy moly. Jeez. <laughs> what in the heck? Okay. Whoa. Somebody feels like there was a misunderstanding. Their wish was not granted. Um, there's a solid foundation, success with effort, but it came out in reverse. Whoever, um, they did not get their wish. They don't have a solid foundation. And Chairfield, someone new is entering your life. Um, I don't really know what to say about this one because it came out like this. But with the victory and with the promotion and with all of this busyness that you're going to be doing a new job yeah someone new is entering your life these people who brought conflict to you they didn't get their wish they weren't able to take it away from you okay A goal-oriented person 
you could be a goal or goal oriented person. And there's a marriage will take place either romantic or business. And that's here in the near future. You've got lovers. And the mother is coming back. The mother is coming back. She's making a, an emergence. This is beautiful. Beautiful. So, so you've got the lovers here. So that could be a, per, a personal marriage. A deep love and union. And it could also be business. I mean, obviously, there's a new position here also. You've got the lovers and a new job and friends. This community that you're celebrating with, this is beautiful. And I could just sit here and ponder it all night long on this camera, but I'm going to turn it off right now and just say I hope this helped, and I'll see you on the next one.